Hey, before this video starts, I just want to say, if you like this content, make sure to like and subscribe to my channel. Also, if you want a video of your own, make sure to commission me either when I'm live on YouTube, or you can DM me through my public Discord server. Anyway, let me not take up your time. Enjoy the video. Hey, uh, do you got a minute? All right. So, uh, about everything that I said back when, uh, we were doing that whole celebration and whatnot. No, 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 I'm not here to, like, uh, like, uh, like, go back on my words or anything like that. I came, I, <clears throat> I came back here to tell you that I, uh, I meant it. Yeah, yeah, I thought this would be a stupid fucking idea. Uh, never mind, um, you, you go back to what you, hmm? Oh, well, um. I, you know, it's, I was a little, well, not little, I was very, very drunk when I said all that stuff to you, and I didn't want to make you uncomfortable with all that stuff, so I wanted to bring myself up here to explain myself. If that's all right with you, I don't want to bother you. Oh, all right. You mind if I sit down and actually have a conversation with you? All right. So, uh, like I said, I came here to, uh, kind of explain myself and try to, uh, clear a few things up. Yeah, so I, uh, I said a few things that I meant, but I was very, very drunk. And I didn't want to have all my feelings come out at one time like that. But the alcohol is sometimes a truth serum in that aspect. But I did mean everything I said. And I do like you. It's just, uh... It's been a while since I've, uh, been able to actually love somebody. It's, uh, been a little bit hard. That's one of the reasons why I did start drinking. And I know I'm not supposed to be spilling out my feelings to all sorts of people that live in this hotel, but... In your situation, it's, uh, it's different. I haven't seen a human in so many years. And, well, I just... I have... Too many feelings that I have inside my body. To express. Because of what I used to have. And I can't really experience that anymore because, well, well, yeah, I'm here. And my love life was back when I was alive. And maybe the drinking was the reason why my love life was oh so bad in the first place, but there's a few things that I can change. And I know I can change. I'm a reasonable adult. And I know when I'm wrong. But I know when I'm right. And what I'm right about is my feelings. Uh, 
Yeah, I, I, yeah, I know. I just, I just met you. I mean, in bad situations, after all. I mean, you did fall out of a portal and whatnot. But like, you know, sometimes feelings are blinding, and when you get blinded by your feelings, you make decisions way too quickly. Well, I mean, yeah, I don't mind being friends with you, honestly. Like I said, it's been a while since I've actually seen a normal human being around here. Instead of them being a fucking demon. But, yeah. I wouldn't mind taking things slow with you. You know, get to know each other first. And make sure we know a lot of things about each other. Before we actually, you know. <laughs> I appreciate that. I appreciate you for actually being a decent human being and not being a piece of shit. <laughs> also, I saw your uh, little nickname that Hell's giving you. Hell's Wanderer, huh? Yeah, that sounds like a pretty badass name to me, honestly. I mean, me, I'm just the bartender. Everyone knows me by the bartender. That's about it. Or just by my name. Yeah, I guess you're right in that. Everyone does come to me when they have to talk about something. So I guess I'm like some sort of, uh... I guess a therapist in that factor. Well, yeah, of course I'm working tonight. I'm always fucking working. <laughs> well, do you want something to drink or, so or anything like that? Or... You're just curious. Oh, uh, you wanted to actually go on a, like a date? Like an actual, like, date date. Like, no bullshitting around, like, just drinking at the bar here. Just actually, like, go out somewhere and actually, like, go on a date with me. Um, yeah. Yeah, I, w I wouldn't mind that at all, honestly. It sounds really nice. Yeah, uh, sure. Um, I could pick you... Wait, no. We we live in the same building. <laughs> I almost said I could, almost, I could go uh, pick you up. At your spot, when then I realized that you live here. For now, I guess. But, um... Yeah, I can, uh, come back here around, like, I don't know, maybe nine, eight. Go to a local bar or something, get some drinks. I could take you out to dinner or something. Yeah, I would like that too. Hell's Wanderer. <laughs> but again I want to say uh, thank you for understanding how I'm feeling and being very kind to me about it I really do appreciate it hmm me and Angel no, we're not a thing. Although sometimes he likes to shove his sexuality down my fucking throat. I still see him as a nice guy. And he's changing. I know he's changing for the better. I've seen him change. Not not in that way. I mean, like, change as in, like, a changing that to, like, a decent person. You know what I mean? Like, rehabilitation and whatnot. <laughs> Yeah. 
Yeah, I, I, I know, I know. I'm just trying to make myself clear so I don't sound like a pervert or some sort. Yeah, yeah. I'll let you get back to whatever you were doing here. And I'll come back up here around like maybe eight, nine, and I'll remind you. And you can get all ready and whatnot for our uh, date, I guess. <laughs> all right. I'll leave you alone now. I'll see you in a bit. I can't, I can't believe they actually let me go on a date, date with them. With them. It's, it's going to be, be one, one of my first, first, dates, dates, first dates, dates in a lot of years. I better, I better make, make this, this one count. count.